Why do 80% of drop toast pieces land butter side down? It's not bad luck. It's rotation. It's not bad luck. It's table height. Let me prove it in 60 seconds. We assume it's clumsiness, but the real culprit is rotation. When toast slides off a table, it pivots around the edge. It picks up angular velocity and starts to rotate. That rotation plus the short fall time is key. Most kitchen tables are about the same height, so the toast usually only has time to rotate, roughly half a turn before hitting the floor. Half a turn means the buttered side ends up facing down. If the table is taller, the toast has more time to spin. It can land any which way. Butter weight can slightly shift the rotation. How much butter is spread also nudges the spin. But the main story is geometry and angles, and it's really about timing and fall duration, not malice from your breakfast. So next time you drop toast, blame Newton, not you. Short drop plus slow rotation equals half a turn. Butter side down. Follow for more bite-sized physics myths.